Good day, good day! How the honk are ya? This is your friend Dan O, and this is Roverland, the YouTube channel that's anything and everything Land Rover. Have I got a video for you today? All right, all right, all right. Welcome to an unboxing Saturday. Yes, sir. We got a couple of things here. Maybe you will find them interesting. Maybe you will not. But either way, make sure you give me a thumbs up, will you? And, and if you're not subscribed, subscribe. Yeah, we're uh, well on our way to a thousand subscribers, uh, 730 some, and that is awesome. I really appreciate everybody that watches and has subscribed. Doesn't cost you a, a thing, and uh, it's awesome. And while, while I'm talking about it, come on over to Facebook. I always point over here for Facebooks. I don't know why, but uh, that's where the Facebooks is, over there. All right, well, let's get started here. Let's take care of this little package here. Uh, I did get, I think I got, yes, I got something from this guy before, and I think it's the same kind of item. Uh, Stow O H. Stow. Uh, S T O W. Yeah. All right, let's see what we got going on here. Yeah, I hope you guys, uh, now it's uh, almost summer out, I hope you guys are getting out and about and finding stuff, and uh, yeah, enjoying this weather, yeah, God, spring weather, yeah, all right, that's well taped and everything here, all right, there we got it, all right, excellent, nice little baggie again, all right, as you see there, it is a Land Rover wannabe, something I do collect though. Ba bam Yes, this is the Jurassic Park, which I'm a big fan of. And this is the Safari uh, Survivor. Yes. And this is the second generation. Um, the first generation had uh, didn't have this uh, added plastic. The tire would stick out through the the uh, you know the whole uh, hood. Uh, but now it's all plastic and actually this one is uh, Except for the the base. This is all plastic the body the roll cage the boxes all that and it just has this uh, base being this uh, the uh, Metal part so yeah very kind of light model, but this is inner I don't know for sure if I have this one or not and that's kind of why I bought it It was like five six bucks and uh, You know, I'm into the Jurassic Park and now that we got it seems like the lights turned on <laughs> Wow, that's nice. All right So yeah, so there it is very very nice. I like that a lot Yes, I, I I do collect Jurassic Park stuff, but not the fantasy ones. Um, the first edition when Jurassic Park came out, of course, I'm saying Jurassic Park, but this is actually Jurassic World. When Jurassic Park first came out, uh, Matchbox had the rights or royalties to that movie, and but they just put it on existing models. So when the Jurassic World came out and a kind of a reboot of the brand, then they started making actual vehicles from the movie, you know, the Jeep and the the uh, Ford Explorer and stuff like that. And so, yeah, and then they got into their Mercedes-Benz and, yeah, really crazy. But anyway, I don't really think I've got that. But anyway, non-Land Rover, but Land Rover. All right, we're going to do this one because I think this is uh, going to be the best one to open up next. <laughs> How's that? Brooklyn, NY. Brooklyn, New York. So now I got to talk like I'm from New York. Yeah, get out of here. <laughs> I don't know why, but uh, every time, you know, somebody, you know, from a different, you got to talk like them, right? All right. So I don't know. Oh, yeah, here we go. Get this out of the box. Get the box out of here. Oh, yeah, I remember this. Yep. Okay, I remember this. And uh, yeah, so awesome. Another box to the collection. All right, you ready? No, they're not sanitized wipes. But bam, yes, I got this 
here. This is the Majorette metal body rubber tire suspension opening parts and licensed vehicle. Yeah, I think I have one of these orange ones. I'm pretty sure I do. Uh, but it was a good price. And ba bam, I bought two because, you know, it combined shipping. And it was a good price anyway. I think they were five or six bucks a piece. And then with the shipping uh, combined with each other, it wasn't a bad situation. So yeah, very, very cool. I, I like I say, I, oh, Jada Toys, huh? They're working in, in uh, cahoots with Jada Toys. That's kind of cool. And maybe there might be some hope for Majorettes to really come over the pond again and uh, really be uh, a presence for diecast that would be nice but very very nice very nice i really like this model it's uh the only thing is it's got such a big honking goofy tail uh tow hitch on the back and you know i don't know if i've ever seen any majorette uh you know trailers i don't know if they sell them separately or not i'm not i'm not rightly sure uh, if you know, comment down below. I mean, it would be nice to have a Majorette trailer, you know, some new stuff uh, to go with my new stuff. All right, this last one, Torrance, Torrance CA. So that would be California. Yeah, let's see what would be the best way to do this. Looks like this is working out right here. If we could do it knife free, that would be safer, right? <laughs> All right, you can always do stuff safer, do stuff safer, that's what I say. All right, this is going to be a good one, I think. Well, you guys can already see what it is. And uh, this was not on eBay, this was on that Merchai America uh, site. It's like America without the A, Merki. But anyway, um, he was a really good price on it. And I'm like, is this mint in the box? And, and he's like, yeah. So uh, yeah, this this thing is even sealed. Wow, wow. So that is cool. I mean, yeah, there's a little damage on the on the box here, you know. But uh, for what I paid, it was like 22 bucks. And uh, with the shipping, yep, you guys see it. I'm opening this up. Uh, I have already done a video on this, but we've got a little bit of time. And so let's open this up with this damaged box. It's no sense of having it in the box. I'm, I'm gonna keep the box, of course. Yeah, I'll keep the box. Yeah, that's cool. Wow, look at how nicely that's wrapped. Boy, wish I could kind of preserve that, but I don't think that's gonna be really possible. If, to you know taped on a tissue paper <laughs> you know that's not gonna hold up but uh, I'm gonna be a little goofy here and see if we can kind of preserve a little bit of it there you go all right well we've got it preserved on video on YouTube that's about all that we need so if you don't know what this is you can kind of see a hint of it there this is the uh, exclusive matchbox um, collector series, I guess they call it. And it is the uh, 1965 Land Rover Gen 2. Yes, look at that, baby. That is awesome. Very, very awesome. I didn't think I would buy another one, but uh, this was hanging around for a while. And uh, I, like I said, I messaged the guy and I said, are, are you really selling? I mean, is this really uh, in the box and stuff like that? And he's like, yeah. So I said, okay, well, I'll, I'll, I'll buy it. So yeah, so that just came out. Didn't that just came out this year, didn't it? I believe so, yeah. So nice little surfer scene on the back of the cardboard there because this has got the surfboards on top yes so let's see if we can kind of get this open in a timely manner here on the uh while the camera's still going you know what i mean and i think we can uh, without breaking a nail that would be nice dan let's not break a nail 
All right, you know what? I'm gonna pause the video for just a second so we don't eat up precious time you watching me struggle, okay? All right, that did, uh, didn't do too bad. <laughs> of course, now that I say that, I didn't take it all the way off because, uh, yeah, it was just, it kind of came undone. So there it is. Wow, that is just sharp. The Land Rover Series 2, and it's the, the uh, what is that, Surf Rider Shop? Awesome, yeah, real rider tires on it, and the works, yes. I don't know if I can get this. You know what? Because this is an unboxing video and this is my second one, hold on, I'm gonna undo this. It's just, uh, look at the writing on the bottom there as well. I'm just gonna grab my uh, Phillips screwdriver and let's take this off, okay? Hold on, just one second. All right, I'm back and we're doing a great job getting this thing out of here and here we go. We're gonna get this off. Oh, come on now. I thought we had it loose, but it didn't didn't go. There we go. It's kind of hard. I got, you know, I would think the right tool, but it was it was really stuck on there. So there we go. And uh, nice little nice little screws there. So yeah, there's the uh, what it looks like without the, the car on it. And I know that's what you're waiting to see. All right, this is it. Yes. Oh yeah. And uh, look at that. They went right through the uh, the post. The, riv the, the, the riveted post and they put threads in that and they didn't have to put any extra holes in the base. So that is really nice. Kind of hard to see the lettering on um, on this, but uh, there's the real rider tires, kind of the, the, well, they don't call it rear riders for matchbox, but uh, yeah. But then also the, uh, you know, this is just like the uh, main line. It, does come off and then the video that I did on the first one of course I didn't take it off the base they do not interchange and this one has got an interior which um, shares the one from the uh, pickup which one is that called uh, yeah you know what I'm talking about but anyway yeah so awesome awesome there we got to see it oh cheese balls let's drop it oh wow yeah so I dropped it Luckily, I've learned from other guys that uh, do this to uh, carpet your area where you're working. And uh, so if you do drop it, it's not a catastrophe, catastrophe. So, all right. Well, there you go, guys. There it is. Awesome. We got it loose. I'm going to keep this one loose, I believe. And, uh, yeah, go from there. Boy, we got dark all of a sudden. But uh, there we go. Thank you guys very much. We're going to get out of here. Thank you for watching another Unboxing Saturday. This is awesome. Hope you guys are finding what you're looking for. And uh, yeah, so this is your friend Dano saying, have a great, uh, well, uh, slow traffic, keep writing. Have a great rover day.